Here at Shea Stadium on Saturday afternoon, the Phillies beat the Mets for the seventh straight time, 5-3. to three. It started as St. Pedro Day. Uh -huh. Pedro Martinez was terrific and was in line for a win. He struck out nine over six innings of work. Yeah, he gave up kind of a cheap run in the first inning on three hits on a broken bat by Aaron Rome, but after that was just outstanding, had a nasty changeup. But what I liked about him, he worked diligently, he worked quickly, he worked with purpose, and he got through six innings. That's the first time in three starts. Mets got three runs off Kyle Loesch in five innings, but they were unable to tack on. The Mets stole six bases to tie a club record, but they got caught three times including a key spot in the sixth. Yeah, it kind of negated all the good work that they had, and then Jose Reyes got caught stealing third base with two outs and David Wright at bat with two runners on. So that would have been giving David a, a great chance to maybe add some and taken away by the uh, caught stealing. Yeah, and it seemed to give the Phillies impetus as well. They got a run in the seventh, and then in the eighth inning, things really came apart. Pedro Feliciano, who had gotten out of the seventh, started the eighth. Yeah, he got another seven, striking out three in a row, but he hung the slider to Aaron Rowan, who's just having an incredible year. He was just a triple short of the cycle in today's game. And then Jimmy Rollins hit this line drive off Jorge Sosa. Ball went all the way to the wall as it fooled Beltran coming out of the shadows. And that was the game. Those were the two runs. That was the difference. Sosa had walked a pair. They both came in to score. Phillies win it 5-3. to three. And so the Mets now lead by four and a half in the National League East, and they'll try and salvage the finale on Sunday afternoon with Oliver Perez on the mound, 12.30 the coverage on SNY.